Here comes main event, Jey Uso. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the bloodline. From San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, main event, Jay Uso! The one thing that hasn't changed about Jay Uso is his unrelenting desire to be at the top of WWE. Yeah, and at this point, I don't think anything can hold him back. Jay Uso has truly reached main event status. Man, I can't wait to see Jay Uso yeet some fools. No yeet. We don't do that, Saxton. Especially I do. you. No. Yeet. Yeet. Oh, yeah. I am pumped for this guy. And his opponent from California, weighing in at 280 pounds, the Samoan Jacob Feltz. This superstar has a lot of confidence, a lot of pride, but there's also a lot of respect for their opposition tonight. Oh, I get it. Great mind games at work. No, Corey, just respect. Oh, so this superstar is just an idiot. Got it. A very high-pressure situation ahead for this guy, but he is more than ready for it. One thing you have to admire about Jey Uso is his passion. When he sets his mind to something, he goes all out to achieve it, even if it means conflict with his closest allies, even his family. Jay is determined to be his own man, and I think that's a very admirable trait. He stood up for himself when others would have bent the knee and just played follow the leader. Even when the choice to do so has landed him in serious trouble, no question, Jay is committed to doing what he believes is best for himself. And he is up against someone who is determined to get the win here no matter what. As both men should be, Saxton. If you're not trying to win, you're not trying. Period. Getting him into the corner. Oh, red right in there. Oh. Ooh. Go for it. Trying to step through. Roll on their belly. Just extending parts that don't extend. Trying to find a way out, using his power to escape. Whoa! Slingshot cross body? That was ridiculous! No sign of hesitation, and that risk gained big rewards. Jey Uso going solo tonight. What do you think his main strategy should be in this match without his brother? Jay has a lot of reps as a singles competitor now. It's important that he believes in himself and the lessons he's learned. They call him main event Jey Uso for a reason. He needs to remember that he's been here before. And now gets tossed into the ring. Escapes in a nick of time. Wicked kick to the face. Boom, what a headbutt. Ducking out of trouble. Oh, what a counter. 
Went into the corner now. A quick reversal by Jay. Float over. Oh. Into a DDT. Oh, what a headbutt. Step up in. Zagiri finds its mark. Look at Jey Uso going top rope. That's right, put your runs up in the air. From the top. Diving elbow drop, are you kidding me? Drops the hammer right on the lower back. He is just reeling from that offense. Jey Uso is willing to pull out all the stops here, whatever it takes. Spear! Jey can seal it here. From. His beating heart will not be stopped. Main event, Jey Uso with a close call right there. He definitely thought he had that one in the bag. Now a series of vicious stops in the turn. Stumps. All the momentum has swung to Jey Uso. Jey Uso showcasing those reps, utilizing that main event confidence he rightfully earned. He gets out of the way. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Jumping clothesline. What agility. And quick response to Jay's offense. He's open to start a rush of his own with that attack. He's been placed in the corner now. Does not stop blows. Every ounce of momentum is now against him. A fully focused Jey Uso right here. These men have shown no indication of staying down. Their guts, their fire won't allow them to give up. Rapid fire Samoan drop. Elbow drop. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. The uppercut. Staved off that attack. Samoan drop. Cover. Shoulder up before the count started. How did he do that? What a punch. Kick right to the face. He's positioning himself. Closing in. that.